You know, the thing that I've enjoyed most about working with Shay and the experience here with the making of an entrepreneur is that it really resonates with the core of who and what I am. And that is to draw out of other individuals things that they didn't know was in them. Their own uniqueness, their own unique talent, skills, gifts. And this experience is doing that for me. That's why you love being in an environment where someone is constantly pushing you, urging you, pulling on you, the best of you, to help you to bring out of, things that, out of yourself things that you didn't even know existed. And so this experience is world class, top of the line. You know, when they talk about top shelf, this is top shelf. Uh, been treated very well here. And I've always admired the work of Shea and his team, but there's nothing like watching the development of them along with the development of myself. And now we come together and this has been a very unique and powerful experience that I would highly recommend for anybody who wants to begin to get their voice out and get their voice heard. The last thing that I'll say that I think is critical. Stephen Covey wrote the seven habits of highly successful people. He had another book though that was released right before he passed away. It was called The Eighth Habit. And the profound thing about The Eighth Habit, it's about mastery. So the seven habits get you effective, but the eighth habit is where you develop mastery. And that eighth habit is when you find your voice. That's half of it. The other half of that eighth habit is that you have to help others find their voice. And so this is what this experience has been for me. Making an entrepreneur, the making of an entrepreneur, Shea Brown and his team, they found their voice. And now they're helping others to discover and find their voices. So I'm just thankful to be here. I'm your brother Bedford, and I'll see you shortly. Oh.